these houses out. And uh, we might leave those houses there. Let's undo that. We definitely want to rotate it here a little bit. It just kind of fits in perfectly with that shape, and that was kind of by accident. Though this is not quite working for me. Um, we got trees in the middle of the road here. And that's the only thing that's really not not jiving. I wonder if we rotate it significantly. If that will do the trick for us. Man. It's kind of not doing the trick. It's not fitting as well because of that. It does. It, it is kind of made to be a square. Yeah. All right. Yeah, it was a nice thought. Okay. Let's see. Let's get this uh, this fitting better. So what is this? That's a school, isn't it? Let's see here. There we go. Okay, elementary school. Yeah, so that's a community school. That's a, they're both basically elementary schools. They're right next to each other. That's kind of close. Um, yeah, I didn't realize they were so close to each other. I don't think that ought to be. So let's take this elementary school and move it. Um, where do we want to move it to? We want to move it to um let's maybe move it to like somewhere over here. Let's stick it. We can stick it right here, and we can create a, a little pathway that that bridges the gap, so people from over here can still get to it. So we'll stick it right there. We need to delete the building that it, it is co-inhabiting with. There we go. And we need to delete that one as well. And then what we'll do is we will stick a pathway right here. Just like that. And that, that's, oh, what is that? Oh, that's a post office, isn't it? Locate the post office as well. I'll just move it down a little bit. There we go. Let's uh, let's move this thing around. I like that. Can move this a little around as well. Make it nice and fit in there. Well, we can even maybe move it back a little bit. Give it, give it some space. I like that. Okay. And that'll be nice. You got you got a crosswalk here. And you'll be able to make it to the school. You got the post office right there. Um, you know, this would, might be a cool place to stick some park or something. We'll, we'll work on that in a little bit. Get our suburbia outlined. Okay, what else we got? Um, but this is looking a lot better, I think. So, we need to go back and figure out what we're going to do with all this space. Let's go back to our Rico here. Let's really explore what we got here. I got so much stuff I don't even know. We looked at these buildings, I think we have. We've looked at all those. We looked at this one. Yeah, we've seen that one. What's this one? That one's kinda cool. That one could easily go right here or something. Let's 
stick that right there. Well, that's a crazy looking building. I don't see how that could ever happen in real life. Having that that cantilever with the, the building actually on top of the cantilever like that. That would just be so expensive even if it if you could make it work. I don't know if you'd want to. Ugh, okay. I like that building right there with the green roof. What's that? Ooh, that's kind of tall. We can maybe bring it back over here. And I'll rotate it out. Is that the end of it? That's the end of it. Okay. So, I think we've kind of gone through our the depth of our what we have here. We can maybe go back down to the low rise stuff and some of the taller stuff here. What's this? Okay, there's that. You know, these are just buildings here. You know, but those these can work, you know. Um, they're still kind of high rise. They're not high rise, but they're definitely they're solidly, I mean they're three stories tall. Three to four stories tall and it actually is it's about right to transition to something like that. Um Yeah, sorry. Okay. Oh look, that looks fantastic going right there on that corner. Just need to take that other little building out. There we go. Yeah, that looks great. So yeah, you, you want to have your buildings be in context, right? So, um, having lines match up with the other lines, that kind of thing always looks great when you can manage it, when you can figure out a way to get it done. And I'll be, I'll be moving these guys around a little bit too. Um, you know, this is a you know kind of an awkward space we want to definitely have courtyard and walkability there uh, we want to think about that we, we got this statue here so we want to be able to, to access that really easily at least by by foot and bike um, let me stick that right there what else we got It's almost like a single, starting to be like larger single family homes here. Take that tree out. Oh, that's the back of this building. Oh, wow. Okay. Well, you gotta go because you're not, you're not cutting the mustard here for us. That's what I had to say about that. Alright. Now let's uh really start to manage this a little bit. So we can push this off of that, give it more sidewalk. Um and then we can maybe rotate this building a little bit more to make it in line with this. And even like cohabitate that hedge and select them both we can have them even both kind of do their thing here where they both kind of give it a little bit of space like that is that a new building or no that's the same building okay yeah, this is a different building so I 
that goes there. And that kind of cohabitates that. It's almost like it was planned, you know. There you go, okay. And then, uh, what we got here? We can rotate that solidly. And have it fit right into that little corner there. That looks great. You know, and then we can um, take a pathway here, and we can bring the pathway straight across, from like right there to here. And that doesn't quite look right, so let's let's move it a little bit, give it a little bit better. And it's okay that we have a little bit of space between that and the hedge. That's just fine. That looks good. Okay. And then we want to make sure that we dezone this. I don't want that to be to, to grow into anything. What we can do is we can maybe just put some assets here, um, some park assets. We could certainly, do, I guess, do our hedges here, <laughs> ones that looked horrible and couldn't really do anything with. It's kind of ridiculous. I don't know. Yeah, maybe we put it like a little gazebo here. You know what I want to do first, though? I want to go back to this. Let's, um, let's create some extra edge here. Do we have to do all this? Can we just go straight? There we go. Just go straight. Oh, wow, look at that. Let's on that. Okay. Yeah, so that looks actually a little bit better, I think. Um, again, we might need to move this up. Oh. That's not what I wanted. Control Z. There we go. Just to get that little extra bit. You know, and it, we don't have to go too crazy with it. Maybe we can pull this out towards the street a little bit. playground or something. I don't like the gazebo, but um, that's not big enough really for that. Interesting. Put a hard curve there. What's that doing? Yeah, leave it like that. Expo line destination display. Interesting. I'm not going to do that right here, but got all kinds of cool assets uh, with all the extra stuff I've been downloading. You can do a bamboo fence. Nice. Not sure that I want to do that here, but I do know that I want to have some sort of fencing going along here so maybe that that's how they finish off their fencing here like that and like that and then they go down to maybe a lower one Looks fantastic, doesn't it? Okay, cool. And um, what else we got here? A beehive. 
I don't know about all that. <laughs> uh, so these planters might work. You might stick them kind of along here. I don't know. I don't like that. You know, the more I do this, the less I like that. So I'm taking that thing out. Okay, we got sandbox. Totally. So we want to do a square one, maybe. A uh, round one's better. Uh, I don't want to do that, but I do. I saw some benches here. I don't want to do some of these kinds of benches. Nice little place for people to go. It's it's not quite a park, but um, it's a nice little place for people to go and take their kids. Ah, oh, that didn't show up. Oh, I hate that. Okay, and we'll we can stick like a little pathfinder there. All right, that's good for that. Okay, let's back out and look at what we're doing here. So what about this building here? I might want to actually bring it back over this way just a tad. And then what we'll do is we'll stick another path in here. Well, maybe we do a dirt path. Right there. There you go. And, uh, yeah, I kind of like the way that dirt path looks for just having it as, like, mulch. But, no, let's, uh, let's not do that there. We will do this here. fix that. We'll just give that a curve. There we go. And uh, I want to take that tree out there. There we go. Keep on pressing V instead of B and that's what's causing some of that. And I need to take this tree out too. That tree don't belong. Okay, we need a we need a really fine-tune these assets I think so let's um get out of this and move this around a little bit I think this needs to just rotate and again that tree just needs to go I don't mind keeping that one. Okay. So. Basically what we're going to have here. This needs to really rotate a little bit. So it's nice and even there. And we kind of want it to be even here. Whatever it is that we do. So. only think we're going to have so much to be able to do there. Yeah, that looks good because that that doesn't have to follow that road exactly because the road is curving. Okay. And so now this is going to... Oh, let's, let's just control Z. Um, I want to control Z that much. Let's select this one now and we'll rotate it to be just a little bit more in line. And we do want it to connect up here. And then we'll rotate. Oh. oh, you're killing me. That's a little bit more. Okay. And we want 
I just like this one now. There we go. And we'll rotate it up. And is that yeah, that's on the ground level, so we don't we want to give it a little bit of space. Have that. And so we'll have a pathway that goes down the middle and that comes this way and that way. Alright, so let's draw our path. So we'll start here and we'll go straight through. Okay, and then we're going to have a path here. It's going to come back, connect, and go straight back that way. We'll have another path that comes right here. Go ahead and make it go nice and straight there. And uh, while we're at it, oh, we know that this one is going to come this way. Go to the edge, and then we're going to have an intersection. Might as well be right over here. Right there. And then this is going to come through here. Like that. And so you notice I'm overlaying on top of building asset assets because uh, people are going to walk the path in a way that they might not otherwise have walked uh, doing it that way. And we'll fine tune using uh, the movement mod. So if I want that to be just a little, like more over there, that looks better to me. That one looks fine. That one, honestly, it looks fine. If anything, this could move over this way a little bit. Let's see how that. Only so much I can do with that. All right, so there you go. Now this one, I think this can come this way a little bit. Definitely want it to meet up with that. There we go. We want this to be a little bit more straight. That all looks good. Um, maybe this one just over just a tad for that, that one's sake. And maybe we need to... Uh oh, we're saving. Okay. I was like, what's going on? There we go. We need to just nudge this, this way a little bit to close that little circle up there. Um, there we go. And then let's stick some trees up in here. Just, just straight up trees. How do these trees look? No, too small, I think. Um, that's a bit too big. There we go. Like that tree. I don't like the autumn tree. Mm, what else we got? Leafy tree. Those look pretty good there. Kind of gives these people some privacy from those people as well. And, uh... Those all look good. I mean, just placing trees. I'm not even really doing much. Just sticking trees. Looks good. Makes it look better. You know? Okay, what about over 
here. This still looks funky. I still need to work on that. Okay. Right, so that's going right there like that. And you can have a pathway there because it goes underneath that building. That that works fine to me. And then that doesn't work as well as it had been. You know, maybe we could move it. Well, I don't know. Honestly, that just needs to go. And we just need to lay some paths down here. So, definitely want a pathway here. It goes along this way. It's also going to come down this way. And then back over. I would say it's also going to connect right there. And this can have also connection this way. Just to give it something more. I think it needs to go all the way over here. And honestly, that'll need to be. And we need to dezone this stuff because that just has no place. Okay, let's uh, let's take this asset and curve it up to the road here. over as necessary okay and I think that can go this way just a wee little bit and I think this can go this way I'm also tapping the arrow keys and you can move it over okay and so that creates a nice solid sidewalk there I think this can curve out this way a little bit. It could also go that way a lot of it. That one's fine. That one's fine. That one's fine. You know, maybe this one can come out this way a little bit. Up oh, took that tree. I don't want to take the tree out. Maybe I just move this asset over a little bit. There we go. And, uh, yeah, so we probably don't want to tree these trees in the middle here. That just doesn't make sense. But what we can have is, uh, yeah, I think I'm going to leave that tree, actually. That one looks fine. This one needs to go. There we go. I do think we can add back some trees though. See what else we got here. No, this is for more of a, a landscape look. Here. Gives it some nice context there. What else? Mm, just some nice big trees. Maybe that one tree that was too big earlier will be perfect for now. Like right there. 
Yeah, that looks great. Right here. Right there. Yeah. Maybe we could also add in the natural trees here. Make that grove a little bit denser. Oh, that didn't quite work. Okay. Yeah, that works. That tree does not work. It needs to go. There's a tree up in there. Can I get to it? I'll just leave it. Nobody's good. Who's going to really notice it? That tree just needs to move. That'll work. So, guys, um, I think that's it for this episode. It certainly was a longer episode, but we got a lot done. We got a lot of uh, a lot of new assets going on over here. That really, I think add to the skyline. Oh, what is this? What? <laughs> okay. Uh, I had I had added that in. I thought it would only be for me to place it. <laughs> it looks so ridiculous. That is an asset that's supposed to replicate uh, the house from Oblivion, um, the movie, with uh, Tom Cruise, and uh, yeah, I don't like it <laughs> right there in the middle of my thing, so we'll have to do something about that, but um, oh, in any case, uh, thank you so much for watching, uh, like, subscribe, Give me comments. Let me know what you like and what you don't like. You know, this is obviously this has been pretty tedious. If you're still listening to me, you you sat through it or you just fast forwarded it to the end. But um, you know, I think it looks pretty good and uh, it gives it a little bit something like this. This feels like it's a lot more part of this than it, it was part of that. But it also is tr a good transition. It's not just like. Um, like it is over here where it's it's just a straight line and that's kind of what you want um, I think what I'm gonna do is make this area parkland um, you know I, I still love to be able to figure out how to get that baseball field in there and um, we'll go from there anyway thanks for watching bye